find out more. We're going to take some time today to get to know a Dr. Yang. He is a professor at the University of Southern Miss, but he's turned entrepreneur where he has created a new line of COVID protection equipment, and he is committed to the fight against this pandemic. So welcome, Dr. Yang. Hello. Good afternoon, Mr. Rebecca, and thank you so much. Hello, everybody. I first have to say and Southern uh, Miss. Also, Mr. Rebecca. I was going to say Southern yes. Miss to the top. That's my alma mater. So you had me at USM professor. Yes. Right. Miss Rebecca, I'm a researcher and uh, in USM. I work with uh, one of the professors in USM, and uh, I work in the lab. Um, so we like Southern Miss. Uh, we have a great team. Yes, well, we'll still claim you as a golden eagle, even if you don't have professor behind your name. Researcher is pretty cool, too, Dr. Yang. So get us started with yes, your sir. business. When did you decide to use your research talents to maybe improve um, equipment for keeping us safe during the pandemic? Oh, thank you so much for a great question. And uh, all everything started from uh, last year um, since March when the pandemic really picked up in the state and we get Libya several months uh, we are off the work and we cannot go to work so we're trying to think about what we can do and uh, that's that's everything start from there so you went for maybe trying to figure out a better way to protect ourselves when it comes to either mask or sort of that respiratory, I guess, spits, the best way I can think of it, or air that comes out of your yeah. nose and mouth. I mean, that's kind of linked to the spread of COVID. So what were you looking at, the mask that we were wearing, and what inside your research brain said we could do better? Thank you. Yeah, and also actually the long journey, and uh, the journey started with when the COVID first started, and the nation always uh, uh, has a shortage about the PPE, uh, like a mask. We do not have enough mask, and by that time, our goal we try to see, hey, how we can utilize our resource to make more mask. Uh, so we turn our idea that we can cut our regular medical mask into four pieces and then we use a duct tape and tape on the face uh, that's how we started we said by doing this we can uh, make our mask a four time more well that's that's good math there right we can take what we've got get four times the use out of it i know that was very helpful in the beginning but that's sort of transformed into your um your sort of nasal mask that we have now if they're watching at supertalk.fm they see a photo of you with it uh, with it on so what what's the end product that you landed on right and uh, that is uh, how uh, things start and uh, of course uh, with uh with the time going on, I think the nation have uh, more supply and they really don't, uh, there are no shortage on the PPE. So we're kind of thinking about huh, wh how we can do to invent a new product to, uh, to protect our community. So one of the things we thought about, we, we think of where uh, the infection happened. And uh, that makes us think about where we don't have any PPE on. So when we wear the mask, we know we have protection. We have a layer of good protection. But when, when we go to restaurant or when we eat in cafeteria, we need to take our mask away. So that's a place that we have no protection with us. And uh, we just said, okay, maybe we can come out something that we can provide a layer of protection when we should take our mask away. And so that came down to a, a sort of a nasal covering. So how does it work, Dr. Yang? Yes, thank you for the question. The, the nasal covering, how they work is that basically we use a medical mask materials and also N95 materials. So basically that's the backbone on that. And uh, on the outside layer, we can put a different fashion design. I like a different fabric, you have different uh, uh, the padding, and if you like a support, you can put your favorite team on it. Uh, so basically, that's the out cover. And uh, inside, between the mask and our skin, uh, you have some uh, specialty medical tape. So they can tape on both sides, uh, so they can uh, work with your nose, and they can stay on. You don't need any strings 
that will stay on very strong. You can do a jogging. You can do all kinds of sport you, you like to, even though falling off. And uh, so when you're breathing through, it's a very comfortable bring, bring in. Uh, so basically all the air will filter through the medical mask and the uh, N95 mask. So have you had any healthcare workers that have tried this out, Dr. Yang? What are you, what are you getting feedback from those who have already given your PSC solutions nasal covering a try? Yeah, that's a, such a good question. And uh, we are and uh, reach out to the medical uh, team. We give some free samples. And uh, we have also a friend who worked with uh, uh, the nursing school. Uh, she tried to take this uh, nasal cover and uh, to ask their student to see how they work. We get uh, some uh, positive feedback from that. Now, I know you've gone all in on your entrepreneurial sort of adventure, Dr. Yang. You've even opened a storefront up there in the Pine Belt area. So can folks come in and, like, try it on? Or it's one of those things I feel like you would need to sort of see up close or sort of test out before you, you know, brought it into your everyday routine. Right. Yeah, that, that is a, a big step for us to step up. And uh, we did everything in our garage. Uh, whatever we do, this invention and uh, make some masks in our garage, in our home. And we are very happy. It's kind of enjoyable. You like to do it. You want to contribute. And also we have a little bit. I like a karate. We do a, a, a karate training in my front yard. And uh, with the pandemic going on, we just feel that uh, uh, there are needs that we, we need to go further uh, to reach out more community and to help. So that's how we uh, decide to to open and uh, uh, the facility uh, on the Hardy Street, close to the Buffalo Water Wing in Hesburg. And uh, we drive that place every day when I go to work and see that building is uh, empty. Uh, just uh, one day I just said, uh, why not we utilize this empty building and do something for COVID? And uh, it turned out the perfect for the PSC solution and also we have Quality Dojo. Um, so it, it matched the same to fight with the COVID perfectly. Well, I think that's awesome. What a great uh, story, though, Dr. Yang, of you just taking your gifts and talents, doing what you can to sort of help during uh, the pandemic, plus also taking up, you know, a space there and helping out the Pine Belt with a new small business. I mean, all around, it just seems like, you know, such a good thing. So you're also online. If we wanted to check out your products or maybe even see some karate, where do we go for that? Yeah, we would be go to. Uh, we are located at One Eight Churchill Street and uh, at uh, Hellsburg, uh, Mississippi. Uh, our zip code three nine four zero two. Our phone number is six zero one three three six zero five one three. We are located to very good business at the Buffalo Waterway and up and down uh, in town. Well, this was you got it all covered, Doctor Yang. When do you find time to to work with your team there at USM? Uh, we we work with the USM the team and uh, all the time the regular the work time and uh, just in the some the side time we we work on there and uh, we're looking for uh, corporations and we're looking for some more professionals step in so that they can help promote and help to for uh, to, to make this uh, product more successful. Uh, we saw this product would be a, a little gift a little gift we have. Uh, we really believe in it and really believe that one day it will help a lot of people. And uh, we just uh, need a nutrient that and help to grow. And uh, regarding the pandemic, we also want to have a couple of words I want to share with our um, beloved Mississippi. And, uh, um, and so you think I can read through this statement? Sure. About the uh, pandemic? Absolutely. Okay. All right. Yeah, thank you so much. Um, so this statement for us to do is like uh, in this pandemic, uh, everybody has a job and a duty to protect others and ourselves. Uh, like a football team in a field, it's not a team of one, two, even 10, but a team of 11. In the fight of the pandemic for the nation, it's not a team of thousands or millions of medical and essential professionals, ministry officers, and the scientists and so on, but a team of 328 million Americans. In this fight, we are 100% employed 
Everybody has a job and a duty to play essential roles. Everybody will be rewarded with a victory and a hero crown. All of us will look into each other's eye and said, we did it. We did it. And Dr. Yang, that is a perfect mm -hmm. note to end on. Thank you so much for your time. Everyone should go to psc-solutions.com or find them on Facebook and support our local Mississippian making a difference. But you guys stick with us. We've got more good things for you.